Should be on. Interruptions, interruptions. Got like when the internet goes off. I wonder if anybody else is watching now. No watchers. No, nobody. That's sad. I blame the internet. The internet cut off on me though. That was a, I wouldn't say it first though, but that was different. Let's see here. I'm going to play a little bit of little coin pusher here. So I like how I won the jackpot though, but I don't get it to, I don't get a credit to my account though, unless I push the currency, that is the items that they put on the coin pusher. It's weird. Congratulations, you win, but you must earn them again. It's like, it's like, Giving you a paycheck from your boss there though, but he decides before he give you before giving you the paycheck he wants you to play a round of poker or something. So the big item to list on there besides the golem though represent and yeah the items that's not the monsters represents my jackpot winnings from before I started the stream. Anyways, uh, w once again, though, welcome to the Dragon Quest of the Stars mobile stream video. And since it is a video that is on mobile, but streaming, you can probably ex expect the usual of uh, disconnections, random cuts in videos. I'm trying to get my currency here. Try to show off somebody something about the game that they just recently got there. Like, nope. Oh, there it goes. Oh, now I give you my prize. Come on, one more. There we go. There's my jackpot winnings. I was waiting till this thing comes out. Oh, I was offline though because my internet decided, hey, break time. So, that was my internet at that time. Event scheduler. Ooh. Ah, still going. I'm going to wait till it finished. Come on. Are you done yet? You're broke. Did you did you at least uh got that chapter done yet? Or at least the uh Abbey of chapter two. Poor Mitchie. Mitchie can't play a second certain part of the game until finish uh, a certain part of the game. Okay, I gotta wait till uh, the coins calm down here. I can leave at any time though, save my progress. Okay. That's what the last person said when I could see it. I can leave at any time. Dude, you just spent our paycheck, but I know. I can feel I'm gonna win. I remember when they used to have casino games and I guess you can call it kids' game like Pokemon, but it's like, nah, we can't have kids uh, do. Um, Gambling, so they remove all the gambling features there. Okay. 
Let's see here. Choco cheese or brick o cheese. That's not a brick. You know what you, what you do? You take the chunk of cheese and you put it in your quart brick. You can only carry one of these. Ah, three. Forget that. I'm carrying the. You know, um, can you imagine getting ready to start a battle there and you see this guy randomly holding a bowl of ramen noodles? And, okay, I'm ready for battle. Why are you holding a bowl of ramen noodles? I don't know. <laughs> to battle we go. Wait, wait, wait. I'm spilling my ramen noodles everywhere. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's see here. Beginner multiplayer. Oh, okay. So, can you try to see if you're able to get on the multiplayer though and join one? Should be able to see mine on their own. Okay, I'm about to uh, hit this one over here. Let's see. Come on. There you go. I should be the idiot wearing glasses holding a bowl of ramen. <laughs> That's not pre-packaged, it's not just add water, it's already prepared. I'm just holding this bowl. I'm holding this bowl, waiting for uh, Mitchie to try to see if she can uh, join in there while the steam is fogging up my glasses. <laughs> Where are they? Where are they? I'm waiting. Oh man, this bowl is a little warm. <laughs> No, did you go? Here, let me back up. Take my bowling needles with me. Did you go where it says join a team? Did you also make sure it's join online, friends only? And did you also push join? Gotta go back up there with my bowling needles. Darn on the toys. Man in the cave. Yeah, you should be able to see me on there, though. I mean, it's like level one. You're probably like already level 100 as soon as you started it. Hmm. Okay, how about this? Uh, you go to multiplayer, you recruit a team. No, did you go? Wait. No, you don't go to recruit. You go to what says join team. You go to the green side. Is that what you did? Did you go to the green side, not the orange side? Because right now you won't see nothing because I didn't. Okay, you uh, try to recruit though and then make sure it's on friends list. Let's see what that happens though. Because you gotta recruit though. Go with says recruit online. Go with says friends only, because it should be on friends only. And then hit recruit. And pick I guess uh, pick one of these. Let's see. Uh, can you do that? Oh, that's 16. Let's see if we can find anything you can pick. Meanwhile, I'm just going to mire this thing. Yeah, so if you do multiplayer, though, you can earn up to about 16,000 gems, though. But for each con consecutive person that you befriend, though, the next uh, gem amount will get less and less. Here we go. By the time you get past uh, uh, 400, then you'll get nothing. Absolutely nothing. Hey, there's an update. After the maintenance on October the 13th, though, 
Uh, the 301 and the 400 bracket will earn you gems. But according to this, you already received gems. Oh, okay, let's see if this works. Yeah, see, I see you right there. But you couldn't see me? Oh no, it's a level 18 though. If only you could find somebody who's like level 60. <laughs> Look, maybe I don't think I could do it though, level 67. <laughs> nope. Like I said, maybe you didn't do it right though, because I did. I whatever it says join and so forth. Hmm. If it was private, I wouldn't be able to join you. So you have no food whatsoever. I'm standing here with a bowl of ramen noodles in my hand. <laughs> Do I have like a crust of bread on your? Nothing. Okay, fine. Okay, so let's see. I got the ability to resurrect. I also pushed the wrong button. I got some antidote. Strong antidote. I got superior medicine, though. And then I got eye drops. Okay, I'm at healing stuff. I have leaves! <laughs> <laughs> we should defeat the evil monster with uh, this leaf I found. Angel Bell. Yeah. I don't know. It should uh, give you a description of what each item does. Each item that you do have. Nee, 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 nee. And here's all the rewards you can get up to tier 20. There's nothing better than chocolate slime. Let's see here. You're slightly resistant to stun and has a slight spell reduction. Yeah. Infernails. All right. Well, I'm just waiting for you. I'm just waiting for you while holding a bowl of ramen noodles. <laughs> yeah, it sometimes does that. I don't know why. Behold, my bowl of ramen noodles. Oh, Yuna and the Warrior of Light. Uses uh, Michia's shield. You got a shield, I'm using you. Wait, who are these people? Oh, are these are the other characters? If you tap on a, the enemy, though, you can target them better. Wow, your, your guys are going to be thrown all over the garden, though. Well, not the garden, but the place. Don't forget, you can move up and down, too. I can't do nothing. I can do this. Ah, I gotta resurrect Michi there. Here, rub the leaf. Rub, 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 rub. <laughs> the Rubbies. What, they're not your characters?
Bonk. Me smash. See, it told you it was like a little more powering. Shield breaker. Just use abilities. Behold, I have a slime over here. Go back to your uh, fantasy that is final. That is not really final. Okay, giant spot of slime monster coming up. Smoosh. What? It didn't work. Oh, that was a one shot there. Hey. Ah, nothing's charged up yet. All I'm going to do is just hit her with a club. Kill the Nichi. I think I gave you too much of a powerful. Oh, well. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. I got her, I got her. I thought I had it. Nah, with lasers. Oh yes, I forgot. She's got her stupid summons ability that shoots lasers. No, Miss Yora, no. Swipe, 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 swipe. Light healers for everyone. I should like sit back and watch everybody else fight. Did I get it? Yes. Finish. All the loot is mine. There. You won't get that extra thing though because you died, so. <laughs> yeah, it's a loot for me. More loot. There. You work with a friend. Oh, I got one thing done. Okay. Ooh. So, what do you think about that? <laughs> so I'm going to try this again, though. Let's see. Recruit. I wonder if it's because I went to uh, the key section, though. I don't know. Because you look at us, 84. Yeah, I'm not that crazy. Let's see, uh, Torching the Stars 3 doesn't come up, though. And see, like I said, though, this is a, a live uh, attack, you know, not... Oh, I pick a character and the, the game does it, though, because there's lots of games that does that. Let's see here. Only for standard... Oh, okay, that's for the standard stuff. Let's see, maybe I could. Now I can also try to do the special section for the story mode here too. Let's see, Let's see if this works. Now don't forget though, for the first time of the day though, the first uh, mission or whatever is basically for free. After that though, it starts charging you some of the stamina. Gotta get food. Mm. 
can grab a slice of pizza instead. Uh -huh. Uh, see, now you can get it. I think it's because it was the key one, though. You probably need your own key to access it. I don't know. I'll try that after this, though. Settings on. Friends only. Password. And see, here's the thing, though. I can also put password, though. So that way, people on my friends list with the password can go in there. So if I don't want everybody on my list who might be active at the time to join in, though, or who can join in, I can say, hey, on my list though here's my password there so I can do the password system okay so according to this though beat him in six turns finish him off with a powerful move which is usually uh, one of his special abilities and do it without dying and look you get bread from a skeleton because yeah Oh, uh, you also see some people with different language ones too there, so. Or I could just speak. Let's see, I had some for my. This is. Yeah. Okay, here it goes. Yeah. It's gonna add my own characters now. Don't worry about the low levels, though. They know what they're doing sometimes. I'm going to battle with a slice of pizza, so yay. Two pizza, here you go. I like how it's, they still keep the same sound effect for when you're uh, going downstairs in the original uh, Dragon Warrior games, Dragon Quest. Also, the arrows just means to go faster. Let's see. Uh, less than zap, though, less magic attack. Now, if you notice, I didn't get close to them, though, and it still activates. That's weird. Turn it up. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I like that music, though. Dun, 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 dun. You also, though, whenever uh, you have enough materials that you can go and upgrade, just go to that tree that has the squirrels. Also, sometimes you'll see some uh, pots or uh, barrels in the back. Tap on them and you'll get some additional uh, loot. You can also hold down to see what each thing does and how long it takes. Like, for example, this one takes 23 seconds and it tells you you got a decent chance of hitting it within four. Also, you can do combo attacks there whenever. Ooh. Sorry for some random delays and cuts there. Dun, 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 dun. Also, if you do a skillful finish though at the end, well not the very end, but at the end of your little mini battle there, you'll get additional uh, refill. Watch this. Say, yeah. If you did tap on there, though, there's some missions that requires you to at least tap on the the barrels and such. If you also go to the squirrel tree, you'll also see a thing called Wandering uh, Adventure. Though, uh, shake mobile device, though, you'll get a little additional thing. Okay, let's see here. Yeah, you know, I think I beat him. Yeah, he did. <laughs> One turn. Loot. I oh, like Mitchie survived. <laughs> and look at this. 
I got like 10 uh, coins and Mitchie gets like two. Why don't you get some pants now? <laughs> okay, here's your two coins. Good job. You can finally buy... Oh, yeah. I need to get one of those medicinal herbs. I keep forgetting that I have too much. Ah, did it again. No, no, I want to go over here. Why do I keep making those stupid things? Sell items. Where is it? <laughs> 999 uh, medicinal herbs. Yeah, I got quite a bit. This might take a while. So how was your day? Fine. All I got was two copper. I found seven leaves on the ground. What you did today? Recipes. Let's see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change that my guys thing over here. No, actually, this is too loud. Yes, do you want to be a character who dances? Yeah, here's a dancer. If you want to be somebody who's fancier at dancing, there you go. Uh, you need a scroll. Well, who would have thought? I'll get my priest out of here. Oh, the first time you change your class, you'll get like a little tiny little cutscene there. It's like, yay, you can do things now. Change you. Oh, wait, no. I wanted to change you. Okay. Okay, go over here. Switch over here. Um, special artist, battle master, battle master. Okay. Switch you around. Yeah, if you want to go trick somebody into thinking like, oh, this guy's a loser. Look at those junk items he's got. You can go like, uh, you can go over here like, redress your character. That's okay. Okay, you're the healer now. Well, right. equip, I'll take it off of her. Okay, take it off of her. Oh, no, wait. I can't. No, I don't use that one. I don't use that one. Okay. This is awkward, though, too. Okay, you can use that. Sleep guard, instant KO guard. Okay, okay. you need claws. Oh, wait. Uh, you have a headpiece for some reason. You can wear that. That way he can wear the hat. No, he can't wear the hat, though. No, okay. No, my, I know nothing. I have so much stuff over here. You know, be the attacker type. Yeah. Are you able to uh, change yours yet? Look at this. If I, if I don't want her to have a shield, though, I can just make it to where she has no shield. Okay. The pilot head. No, I don't want to zoom in. Let's see. Uh, if you have access, if you finally did the uh, thing where you can change it, though, go with this attributes and vocation. Then you'll get the yellow ones to choose from. Most of the yellow ones to choose from. Because apparently some of these requires other things. Like I said though, the red ones, you need a, a special scroll to get them. 
If you want to change your class, though, if you uh, skills, on the other hand, though, I don't remember. The skills are mostly based on the uh, items themselves, though. Because if I hold down, though, there's your skills. Now, the w main skills on most items you cannot really change out, though. But the secondary, you can. To change those, you go to the squirrel tree over here. Go to Upgrade Workshop, and there's where you can find it. This is how you change the skills on your items. Let's see. Also, if you have, let's say, multiple of items there that you don't really care for anymore, but they have some skills that you do want to keep, you can uh, go over to them, though, and uh, take them out. Uh, let's see. Gnarled bow. Okay. It says... Like right here, though, if I want to take one of these, can I take this one? No, I cannot take it because it's set in there, but I can take this, though. I should be able to take that one, right? I think I can take it. Okay. Anyways, so if I push this button right here, the thing is, though, you won't be able to keep the item in the world because you're basically just breaking it. Like you just snap it over your knee or something like that. Oh, look, it's got some stuff on my boat. Ah, junk. <laughs> so if I go like this, now I got the abilities, but I don't got no more bow. So so if you need the money, which in this case you shouldn't really need that much money though, considering I got like 57 gold pieces there, then don't do that though, you can sell everything as is though. However, if you want the skills though, you can just go ahead and destroy it though, and take out the items there. Now, like in some games, though, you can evolve items, though, but there are limitations, though. Let's see here. What's that? I got this weird thing going on here. Can I do this? Now, whenever you get certain items, though, these little bits, though, you can do that, though. Or, if you got a similar item, you can do that as well. Let's see here. I'm going to do... Uh, Oh, wait, that might be too much. I was, yeah, that was too much. There we go. 50 gold. Oh, I need to do that. Okay. Yeah, it's been enhanced. Think. More attack power. Oh. I guess I could have got more. Oops. Okay. I wasn't sure. Can I do max? Okay. That was it. Oh, I put too much. Okay, how about that? Is that enough? Skip. You see one level up, you've seen them all. Always try to upgrade your items as best you can, though. Even the basic ones. At least until you get better ones. Just remember, when you do this, you're actually destroying the items to improve on whichever one you're doing. Same thing with the material as well. You know, let's just skip this. I'm going to be here all day. Evolve equipment... Do I have anything I can do it? Now this is where you can combine the exact same item together though. What I'll do is sometimes we'll add a new skill slot. Like in this case, two boomerangs. So if I use the boomerang that I lock, I usually lock one copy. And any additional copies I don't care for, I'll use that as material source or equipment involved. So like I hear, if I combine another bronze boomerang, it now gives me a D slot. As you can see, the D slot is actually for a spell attack. Or skill, I should say. So let's, here we go. 
We glued two boomerangs together. That's actually what they're saying. <laughs> also, the skill has also been increased. As you can tell, it says 15 now, which means that I wanted to improve on it, though. Now the limit's been raised up. So now, if I wanted to, I can go to the boomerang again. Boomerang. I forgot the boomerang. Where's the boomerang at? There we go. I can go over here. I, I can go over here. I should go over here. Oh, that's upgrade, not install. I can't read. If I go to the right one. Okay, set. I can't read. <laughs> okay, so now if I go over here, tap on this. Now I, I can only use D class one, so. Because see, I can't use these, I can't use these. I can't use these, I use that. Because these are not the right abilities. Now I can use anything that hasn't been set already. Now as you can tell, each one does something different, except for I got Zam. Which does this. You hold it down to see the information for it too. Also, if they're already set in the weapon though, and you're wondering which weapon it is without back and forth, you can also see what item is on. Like this one though, Z Zam is on the edge boomerang. So let's say if I want Fritz. There we go, now I have Fritz. If you notice though, there is a level number there. If you haven't figured out that though, you can go back over here upgrade let's go back over here again why do I have the switch in so now let's say if I want to upgrade Fritz so I can go over here now if I have the right material there I can use those or if I got an extra copy of let's say Fritz there like I do several of them a lot of them I can do this I can do this and this and this and this Now, if you notice though, it goes up. So now it'll be 2 5, which means the damage will be better. And it'll take less time. In this case, two seconds less. Now we skip the animation though, because apparently you won't see that. They just circle around. But of course, in this case though, the level cap is 5. So that means I can keep going until I meet 5. There is other ways you can also increase the amount too. And this is something new as well though, but I don't have anything mastered out yet, so can't do that. So you want to try another uh, little quest there? Also, while well, I'm waiting for a response there, like I said, don't forget to also check on your maps here too. Each uh, update will also give you a new map too. Sometimes if you complete one map, like this right here says beginners, you'll get the next one, which will be uh, intermediate, advanced, and so forth. Like right here though, I just need to clear two more multiplayer dungeons. Also, if I completely complete the map though, I get the big prize, which would be this. Like in this case, though, I can get the items for the Final Fantasy event, though, as well as the 100 gems. Like I said, gems come in plentiful there, so you don't have to ever pay for it, though. Okay, let's see. Let's see this. Okay, let me see if I can try to do a key dungeon here. I don't know if I can or not. Let's try this. The Legend of Erdrick. It doesn't show anything about keys, it just shows it. Okay, see if we can find this one though. You know what? I forgot to switch my weapon because I'm still using a club. Oops. The maps reward you though. They have 
specific task. Some has difficulty uh, levels as well. Each task will give you a reward. Completion of each of every task level will give you a bigger and better reward. If a uh, map has, let's say, a level advancement, though, it will go to the next difficulty, and you can keep doing that, though. Some will require additional help from others, though. Some can only be accomplished solo. Some can only be accomplished multiplayer. I might have to hurt my guys. You can also get more uh, personal maps there. If you go, like I said, to a squirrel tree, though. See, now you're on there. If you go to a squirrel tree there, go to where it says One Room Adventure. I'll tell you to check your phone, though. You'll get a map that way. But some maps do have a limited time on them, too. Mostly they're advanced ones. Let's see here. Oh, yeah. Should I walk around while holding a plate of pancakes? <laughs> Throw it at the enemy, confuse them. Sir, why does he have a plate of pancakes? I don't know. Ah, oh, man. Oh, God. Yeah. Also, some events you can get little badges. Some story modes you can get little badges, like these right here. They're just basically to show off. Like this one I got during the first event there where they had Dragon Warrior quest. Don't mind me if I say Dragon Warrior because I keep referring to that. One. Okay, this is level one. If you lose on a level one, no pancakes for you. I'm gonna hoard the, this plate of pancakes. As soon as we enter the I'm just gonna toss it in my face and say, yep, I'm energized. But I wanted the pancakes. Also, though, if you do pay the uh, that season pass, I guess you want to call it, though, you can also increase the speed three times as fast. <laughs> also, if you're high enough level, though, and you're going against a in a low level dungeon for multiplayer, you don't have to wait for additional players though. If you think you're confident enough with your other characters though, you can also uh, just go ahead. Like in this example though, you can see my other two characters. The ball over there. Hello, Bala. You're here to watch me uh, eat my plate of pancakes though and not give any to Mitchy. Mitchy's being mean. Well, Mitchie, you do know the first time you do that, though, it's free. So, unless you did it twice, though, you shouldn't be able to pay for anything. Even it says it's free for the first time. You went on Twitch and saw Dan. Dan who? There's no Dan here. This is a Game with D Gaming, yeah. I'm playing uh, Dragon Quest of the Stars, though, because apparently Mitchie didn't know I was been playing it for months now. <laughs> How come, how'd you get it before I did? Because I got it beforehand. Yes, like I said though, this game's been out for months now there. So that's how I'm such a high level. Not the highest level I could have been because I took a break. Because, you know, I kept beating all the story mode. That's why I'm like 67. Ooh, it's Robin Ed. Oh no, not 10. I'm just gonna sit back and let uh, Mitchie do all the attacks, huh? Hey, Mitchie, you think you can handle a level one? I don't think Mitchie was able to do a level one. Combo!
Yeah, that's what I said. It's free for the first 30 days. But you just said over here at, what is it? Yeah, I picked the the night. Yeah, the eight ninety nine there. I thought like you paid for it. How did you know that? I think I got a sneeze here. Da, 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 da. Oh, I didn't notice that. Did you see that? You also get to show points for uh, getting the badge too. Let's see how much Mitchy gets. Let's see. Mitchy gets nothing. Sorry, Mitchy. You got nothing. I got cake. Actually, technically, you got cake too, so. Oh, you wanted to attack too? Dang. Yeah. I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> ah, boo. I forgot to equip the staff. Mine. I don't mind. Yay, friend points. Once again, here's the rewards, though, for a friend, though. As soon as you get to tier 10, you get 500 gems. So look all those gems that you get. And see, if you notice, though, the thing pops up for the map completion. <laughs> poke. I poke the screen. Let's see. I'm going to my board over here. Oh, wait, I didn't get. Once again, anybody uh, joining in wondering why this Final Fantasy and a Dragon Quest game, though, they're having a crossover game event. Let's see here. There is an outfit over here because everybody wants to dress like a move on it. Wait, how many panels? Two more. Wait, did I exit it? I did think I did exit. I need to open two more. Okay, I need a ten, so let's see here. Break this open. Oh, I see. Every time I do it, it breaks it more. Okay. I can't read. Okay, there it goes. No, you said... Ah, oh, you stupid thing. Am I supposed to break the ones next to it? I bet I am. I want to do this like a Moogle in, a, in the wrong game. Okay. Oh, yes, because I want to look like uh, Titus's, Titus's dad over there. The best key to get is the King Metal. I mean, Metal King. Same difference. Let's see here. Ooh, like a metal powder. Okay, let's go to the Cactar over here. What do we got here? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, ha, 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 ha. I see what's going on here. The boards were not next to each other. I didn't even have to go that far. Oops. I'm such a genius. Okay. The Moog head. You know what? I want to keep this, though, and try to get some more. Okay. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Back up, back up. Back. I said back up, you stupid thing. No, keep going. Let's see, friends only. No, not that one. Not that one. This one. Oh, now they're both open. Okay, that gives me one crystal then. Thanks. You're crazy. No, it says I got a 44 of those. How many do I need for that again? Yeah, I got 44 of those. How many did it say I need it? Oh. 
Yo, I have... Uh, was it because of stupid things in a way? I bet it's because of stupid things in a way, right? Yes, darn it. I have to break these open first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got the mage's robes? Okay, break it open. And now I have to go get some more crystals. Arrgh. Okay, so what I'm going to do... Wait, which one I did? I don't know. The one I did was the other one, wasn't it? Okay, so. Yeah, because some games uses the uh, three star, three icon system, though, but usually it depends on if you lived or whatever. Okay, on this one, I need a spell attack. Do you want to Oh, that should be easy to do. I like you get a shield, too. Not the best shield, though, but you can keep some of the items just for looks. And you get chocolate cake. And it's a level four. So what I'm going to do, switch my guy out for a lower level. Yeah, I'll be a mage. Because we all know mages really use whips, don't they? Hee 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 hee. There'll be a golem over here. No, that's not it. Come on, I need something that might. No, nothing. Okay. There's supposed to be one in here that's compatible. I forgot how I did it. Oh, well. no! Get off his! Get off his face! Get off his face! I uh, forget it. I'm gonna switch it out. Okay. She had the body. Pants. Now, if that isn't awkward enough, I don't know what. <laughs> uh, what's the warm warehouse key? I forgot that what that was. Huh? Oh, wait. I got something in the mail. Okay, hold on. I got something in the mail. First time meeting somebody. Oh, really? You met one person. Yay. I'll deal with that later. Let's see here. No, gotta go. Gotta go higher difficulty. I gotta sneeze. One moment. Ugh, sneeze. Ugh. Okay, what does that say? On the map, clicking on the shiny stars, I'm getting all these, though. I didn't know I had to click them. Uh, yes, you have to click them. Okay, spell. 
Who cares about Arachi over here, though? Just for cake. I'm hungry. I gotta kill a monster. Just got chocolate cake. Also, don't forget to look on your uh, the boxes where you can get where you can spend your gems on there because there's one of them you can get free once per day. Oh, there's much my leg on. Leg. I hope I didn't left on uh, D Live. Oops, I bet I did. Hold on. Yeah, you know where you spent your gems to get your items and such. Uh, the one on the bottom. I think it's the one on the lower bottom where you spent it though. You can also uh, get it for free once per day though. So you only get one item at a time. <laughs> oh, in case anybody's wondering where I got the gold man outfit, though, it's because it was an event where you had to go after the golems, demons, and there was another one, though. Anyways, you can uh, earn pieces to craft their uh, outfits. Oh, uh, you're in a dress now. Oh, wait, meteoric sword? Ooh, nice. That's a good sword. Ah, oh, but because your outfit is for a mage, though, you won't get the benefit. Kick me out of the team at lobby. That's the way we're saying it. Oh, look, you got ham. Oh, she she's showing off now. She's got a big uh, big ham over there. Let's see, what was ham do? Bespoke ham made with the chef's touch, eat to boast your strength and mitten. Made of meat and pepper. Proper. Oh, yeah, well, um, uh, um, uh, yes, I'll eat some of this. Totally not donuts, according to somebody. Oh, yes, yeah, so I forgot to change those too. Who cares? The only problem is, though, when you use your other characters as stand ins, you cannot give them food. They'll just go at it with foodless. I'm a yellow thang. No, that's the uh, gold golem, also known as the gold man and everything else, though. On the original game, though, if you never played the original game, he was the most valuable one because he's the one that can give you the most uh, gold that wasn't a boss. Just like uh, the metal slimes was the ones that gives you the most for experience. Let me turn this up. I hate these bomb type ones, though. Yeah, the little demon one actually has a, a fork for a weapon. The slime has a slime shield. Oh, wait. Okay, I need to finish off with the spell on this last one, okay? See, I can't pause a live game. I'll just continue on while I'm looking. Which means I need to do this. Dun, dun. Strength and resilience. Also, make sure to use food that's more appropriate for the dungeon. Don't, like, say, I'm going to use uh, ice resistance, though, when it's actually should be fire resistance. 
Oh, wait. I almost was trying to move Mitchie there. Oh, no. I'm not. No, not my healing. Also, in case you're in a uh, group, though, where somebody leaves the group, though, it'll make you or, the, you or whoever the host in charge. How to add heal. No, the, like I said, the spells and other attacks is mostly uh, affiliated with your uh, weapons. Although you do get some abilities, though, whenever you switch class, though. Mmm, metal cake, because nothing better than crunchy metal cake. Let's see. Mm, more metal cake. That could break my teeth on it. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, there's my chocolate. You don't know what fruits to use yet? Yeah, if you uh, play one of the dungeons enough times, though, you'll get an idea. Block. Oh, look, I completed a map. No, I said go to the map, you dumb thing. There we go. The whole map's completed, so I get the additional stuff. Since I was a beginner, I go to the next one. Get the bonus. And there we go. Advanced. So now let's do it seven times. Uh, t -t 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 clear one or two. Eat food. Any food will do. So if you want to stuff yourself with cake there made of metal, go for it. Uh, do that two or three times. Collect some gems, I mean crystals. And do that to any time. Okay. <laughs> you got the mage's head? Nice. Because, like I said, though, uh, let's see. Like I said, you will get certain spells and such based on your class. Like right now, mage, as I level up, I'll get access to the fire attack called Sizz, as you can see right here. However, though, if I was to go to the wrong section there, let's go, uh, let's go to vocation. Now, if you look over here, like I said, the basic stuff will be just mostly abilities and spells that are associated with your class. But if you go to like the higher level ones like this, you can see that some of them requires you to, uh, there we go. Like this right here. Bonus. If your if your requirements are met, though, you'll get your basic bonus. Like I right hear the priest ability, though. Each time you level up another class to 50, though, you'll get an additional ability. Like let's say, for example, if I go to my mage, my sage here. Okay, I have a 50 mage priest, which means I get the ability of the priest attacks and the mage attacks as I keep leveling up though like for example my priest now I get more health so you see it's better to try to level every basic class up though that way whenever you use your advanced characters I'm in mean, class there you'll gain uh, better abilities like right here though by the time you get to the max level of 99 that's right here ah, here it goes mage and priest which is the ones that are required to use a sage because they're supposed to be a holy magical dude you'll get increased luck though now for example if i was to obtain any of them though at 50 though i'll get a special badge let's see what does that badge do yeah you'll get this badge right here which you can apply to your items if that makes any sense though now if i was to uh, level up a paladin though then I'll get the abilities of a paladin as well. If I keep leveling my sage, I'll get some more stuff. Let's see, look, if you level up more of the specialty characters, though, I'm in classes, though, you also get their abilities. 
If you manage somehow to level all the specialty ones that was available, you'll get this one. So yeah, fun, fun, fun. But like I said though, to get those, you'll have to go over here, go to daily and go to the temple. <clears throat> Every day the temple will ra randomly give you three to choose from. Well, they're not random, they're actually rotate. There we go. These will, this is the schedule that shows you what each class, events class is available. As you can see, it's like every other day for most of these though. So right now though, the Sage, a Pirate, and a Monster Masher, Master, not Masher, is available. I do the Monster Mash. Now here's the thing though. You have to earn one scroll per character. You don't have to keep doing all of them. The first one will do, like right here. Sage powder. Oh, they added the alchemy stuff. At least I don't think you had to. Oh, I never did the How did I get the sage one then? Okay. Huh, weird. Anyways, that's how you get that though. That's how you get your advanced stuff. Now, even though it says 40 for the minimal one though, I suggest at least level 50 with decent gear, not just go out there like you just bought something out of the uh, Lost and Found box. <laughs> I mean, if you're able to, then go for it, but if not, how do you get the metal stuff? The metal stuff or the metal stuff? What stuff? I'm waiting for a, an unseen uh, comment up here because for some reason my stream does not want to show the comments over here. What kind of metal stuff? Okay, let's see here. When I started the game, I thought I would have three crowns to be able to go to the next boss. Oh, the, uh, the crowns? No. You just need at least one to advance to the next one, though, or completion there. Each crown will represent a, a certain challenge, though. But, no, you don't really need to uh, get all three of them, though. Like right here, it says I completed it. It says complete. Even though I got no crowns, because I already beaten his butt one t a couple of times, even though I don't get the crowns. So the next one, new, will indicate, hey, he's the next one in line. As you can tell, the question mark guy down here, though, he's darkened. Not too much darkened. But because I didn't beat this guy up here, the middle one. Ah, dang it. I need to sell some stuff while I'm at it. Uh, but because the other one says new. Let's see here. Then the one on the bottom does not give me anything there. Dump you guys in there. I'll, I'll do this off stream here. There goes. But yeah, you don't have to get a crown or whatever as long as you try to complete it. So make sure you got enough leaves there to resurrect though if you're having issues though. But yeah. If they say new, like this middle one there, then yeah, you can. Uh, Attempt that though as you can tell I couldn't attempt it though because that was before I was over 60 But I'm gonna wait till I'm like level 70 Oh, uh, you're talking about the crowns there. Yeah Later on in the story though, you'll get gain the ability to uh, make these little squirrels or go after items around the world there like this The squills. The more temples you unlock that gives you items, the better. Like I hear. I 
Also, as you progress in the story, you'll get uh, extra stuff there. Let's see here. Chunk of cheese. Let's see. Anything special or special? Mm, candy. Uh, da, 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 da. Coffee. Coffee, 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 coffee. Go make you some coffee. If I'm right, though, the upgraded version of coffee is cappuccino. I tell him to make coffee, and look, he's like karate chopping something over there. Where's the other one at? Oh, behind him. Why are you karate chopping the table? That's not how you make coffee. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to watch him do some karate chopping to the table just to make coffee. Yeah, okay, whatever. Oh, it was latte. So the upgraded version of coffee is latte. Yeah, you can see the difference though, because that's what coffee gives you up there. 40-20, and latte does this. Let's see here. Okay. And no, no, okay. I can't do anything else. Equipment forge. Yeah, see, here's a special item, though. But unfortunately, the event's over, so I can't make any more. Oh, wait, 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 go back. Okay, that's for something else. There we go. Anyways, this is how you get some more maps over here. Think, ooh, it's a purple one. Let's see what I got. Oh, that's the easiest one. Destroy our pots and go to the food door one time. Yay. Let's go legend mode. Yes. <laughs> Good lord, that's a lot. Are you ready to go to legend mode? Yes. No, wait. That wasn't it. Okay, I think Michi gets the idea of how this plays. Let's go to legendary mode now. It's like you're crazy. Hey, you want to earn some hair? Also, if you do the solo version of these, you'll still get the same uh, items, though. There'll be some exceptions, though. Look at this, though. You can get hair and some priest gear, as well as more cake, because that makes sense. I don't know. Oh, I just need to do a basic attack for that one. But yeah, if you go on the solo section though and do the, uh, and if you get keys, you can also get some keys over by the scroll tree as well. Anyways, you can do the uh, metal slime ones though and they'll give you a lot of uh, experience like they always have. If you're able to uh, collect enough, though, you can also get the uh, King Metal one, which gives you the best experience, so. 
But like always though, with the Dragon Quest games, so make sure you have the Metal Slime uh, weapons there because that'll give you pretty much 100% guarantee of hitting. And of course that some of them will give you additional bonus there, like one shot. Let's see here. Wait, what does the flower do? I'll wake somebody up. Rub the flower in their face. Smell it! Smell the flower! Cures paralysis, cures paralysis, cures of confusion, antidote. Anti-dope. Anti-dope? Sure. I'll just get some more leaves. Just rub it in somebody's... Uh, good lord, now you're a witch. <laughs> yeah, it's like... It's like... A crumb of bread, a lo small loaf of bread, and you get your bigger loaf of bread. Where are you going? What food should I bring? I have no idea what's over here. Just don't bring any higher quality uh, food there that you have very little of. I'm bringing some spaghetti, Joe. This is a beginner, so, so I don't really see anything wrong with it, though. These are the monsters, though. Hmm. Uh, they just do basic attacks, as far as I remember. I know there's some versions of the uh, zombie where they can pro give you paralysis, though. I remember though in the older games where they didn't do crosses though because of the religious thing going on with Nintendo there so they had to change it to something else because pitchforks are the better way. I'm surprised this thing's been going on for about an hour, technically a little bit longer than an hour, but since the internet decided they wanted to cut. Oh, you're bringing slime cake. Ooh. Now, when it says preferred weapon, though, that means... Remember, that means whatever weapon... Technically, you use whatever weapon you want to the ways. But if you br use the right and correct weapon, you get the little bonus, though. Did I push it right? I did. One little pilot over there. I remember, what was it, the first few weeks I was playing this, though, I was dressing my guy there like he was a beginner still. That's one thing I like about the little appearance changing option there. So you can, like I said before, though, you can look like a homeless person if you wanted to. Behold, my plate of spaghetti. Oh, yeah, that's correct. Look at my guy, how he walks with his staff there. Okay, I have to do the basic attack. On the final boss, that is. Not right now.
So yeah, sometimes uh, using the metal items or metal slime uh, items, I should say, though, just to clarify, because a lot of weapons are made of metal. But I mean, the particular ones, though, they're usually the better ones, so... Well, not the best one, though, because they have the uh, high critical attack and so forth. Though. They can't hit art very hard, you know what I'm saying? Oh, this is, uh, yeah, it's not too bad. I swear, it's, it's a long treadmill over here. I wish I meditate on this. But nothing happens. Oh, that's a healing one. Oops. Okay, wait. It's supposed to be the basic one again? Uh, yes, basic attack. Okay. <laughs> okay, that should be about it right there. Do, do, do. Ah! Got my keyboard stuck on me there. Oh. That's an awkward looking priest there. Aha. Uh -huh. But it's not a priest. Because I've got to change the outfit again. <coughs> dun, 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 dun. Congratulations, you got cake. Oh, there's also something I forgot to show, though. Let me do that as soon as this is over. More cake. What? I didn't... Uh, I didn't do the... La mm, I didn't do the basic ability. I'm not going to worry about it, though. I was going to show something over here while I'm at it. No, this is not what I was going to show you. I'm just picking things up. So was it this one? Yeah, there is a dungeon you could get uh, tickets at though, and you can buy these right here. Let's see. No, okay, I need to hold it down right here. Yeah, you get this stuff, you can get some good effects. Here. Let's see here. Uh, points. 50,000 points? You crazy? Let's see, where is that one uh, key at? Okay, so what I need to do is sell some stuff. Yes, I see the dumb thing. Now, you can get these right here. These are actually can be used as a basic shield. Or you can sell them for points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I don't have enough. Anyways, like I said, there are some dungeons you can level use to level up. Where is it? Now this is these are usually for solo ones though. I'm just gonna show off real quick. Okay, let's see. Uh, t -t 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 -t. One more key. Okay, I'm gonna switch my weapons out real quick. Uh, no, nothing for him. Hey, nothing for you either. How good are you? Oh, surely you have. Yeah, you got the claws. Okay, you should be good. 
I need to get the tickets. Uh, the tickets should be in one of these dungeons over here. Yeah, right here. That's where you get your tickets at. See? You can only do one per day, though. Let's see here. Oh, try a dungeon. Gotta look at slime. Metal slime. See, I'm gonna go to my friend list over here. Let's see here. No, not you. Uh, sure. That face. Okay, I'm just gonna do this real quick. I wanna. Wait, I know we have one here that increases it even more, but where is it? I don't. No. Oh. Yes. We hold I have cake. <laughs> no, I just like original uh the game though. That hitting a metal slime or any of its relatives is hard to do. Because they got high defense and very low health. If I remember right though, the uh, metal slimes, the basic ones, usually have four health points. They can also use fire attacks, but they are also known to run off very quickly. They make it look like they're going to do something big to you and then just run away. Like I said, the best ones are the king ones, the big metal ones. As you can see right here, this shows you though the chances of hitting like uh where is it like this one against metal there so if i use this right here let's see how much of attack let's see metallic rain against metal they're also very resistant against spells so they basically do nothing to them So even the strongest attack just basically does nothing though. Just gotta make sure that they do damage to metals. So look at big hit, one point. Sad. So you look at nothing. Also, you might want to try to focus on at a time. Look, if I did this though, it doesn't really do anything. Well, say. Big hits. So yeah, so having the metal slime item so does pretty good damage. Now we'll go to the final boss. Which is a collection of them. So I guess it does nothing right here. Plus we just tickle them. <coughs> but by default though, without using a special ability though, the metal slime weapons will still strike out at least one point of damage.
Come on, come on. This might take us some time. Ah, darn it. Okay, let's see how much experience I got from over here. I'm already high level though, so it won't get too much. There. This is how much experience I just got from the liquid slimes, like they're called. You may think this is cheating though, but hey. If it was cheating, they wouldn't give you the option. So you looking away to power level, this is the way to do it. There are some map rewards that also give you these keys as well. Ooh, sizzle level one. If you're tired of listening to the repeat there, you can always hit skip. And then boom. So look at I gained like what was it? Almost uh, 15 levels on my main character there. You won't get that much uh, gold though because they're known for experience gains, not money. And did that. Okay, so I'm going to do one more uh, one more thing there. This will be the last one, though, since it's, as you can tell, it's almost 2 o'clock central time here. Okay, before I do anything, what do I have to do on this one? Oh, use a power move, though, and then you'll get a staff and a priest hat. Okay, here we go. Last one, and I'm doing everything else off stream here. Yeah, 16 levels. Am I having loading issues? Here it goes. Two o'clock. Wow. Come on. Sink. Sink, sink. I'm going to get some metal uh, cake, because why not? You can use, if I'm right though, you can use the same uh, food there. But like I said, if you do, uh, yeah, I figured as much. Of, if you uh, do randoms and such, or which sometimes they may or may not appear though, try to match up the same type of food. It's better to have different flavors though. You can use your uh, metal ones though, even though they're mostly just used for uh, experience gains. You telling me? Let's go, boot. Especially if it's higher levels there, you might want to not use the metal food there. But yeah, give it a go, Mitchie, there, whenever you get around to it, though, with the randoms. And also try to befriend some. You don't have to uh, have them, uh, you know, online, though. You can just use the characters whenever they're on your list. It reminds me of uh, Final Fantasy Record Keeper as well, where the characters are just there. They have their own weapons and so forth, based on whatever the players give them. They have their own special ability. Why is this not going? Is it not pushing? Okay, there it goes. I mean, you can always... Uh, 
find somebody to play with, though. But then being online at the same time, yeah. Oh. Oh, you didn't see how I did it, though? Okay, I'll show you again though, after this, then. Don't worry if it says sinking, though, because it's been like that ever since the game came out. I bought an extra leaf though because I got a so I got a feeling you might get killed over here. But yeah, it's better to stick with one uh, class there, level it up to about 50 though, and then you can switch forever. <clears throat> In some games, you can only uh, use uh, from the short list of people. So if you like have 200 people on your main list, though, it'll usually give you like five or six or whatever. On this one, you can keep uh, rotating. No, yeah. I wouldn't take it. I didn't do it in time. Oh, wait, what was I supposed to do over here? Oh, just attack with a big hit. Nothing special, okay. Keep walking, keep walking. I like this treadmill of a floor. Oh, finally got off the treadmill. There's also an item over there in the ticket section there where we can get the... Uh, Accessory that allows you to use the Molten King over here. Molted. Molded. Molded? The big slime. Yeah, like I said, though, whenever you upgrade your items, though, it will reduce the uh, wait time. Sinking, sinking, sinking. Yeah, let's all pretend to be stone statues here, right? Wow, you stupid game. It's not my internet this time, though, because otherwise I won't be talking. Come on, game. You need a no. Since I left, that's weird. The stream is running, though, so I don't know what's going on. Hmm. Ah. Uh, let's see if I can try to join in. I should be able to get back in. I should be okay. You should see me uh, pop back in now. Okay. There. Am I back in yet? Yeah, it's likely the game. It, like I said, done that before. Yeah, that's whenever uh, the host leaves, uh, you'll get access to their character. They won't. The host that leaves won't get any benefit if they uh, don't join back in. You will though.
Come on. Yeah, it's got to be the game, because like I said, if it was the internet, though, the stream would have uh, ended. This is the longest tunnel, I mean, a uh, hallway. Come on, join back in. We keep walking and walk. Okay, there it goes. Oh, uh, yes, old English. Yeah. Come on. I need to do a power move. Oh, uh, I guess I'll have to heal Mitchie too. There, you got healed. I hope you're happy now. There. Watch it, they'll be like, okay, you got two gold pieces, that's it. That's the first time I had to rejoin my own battle there. Oh, my priest gets the extra bonus because I got the item. Okay, that's why. Uh, I only get the special thing. Oh. Ooh, more slime. Yes, yes, yes. There, you got some more cake now. And there was a three crown thing there. Okay. Uh, I pushed the wrong one. So you want to know how to get the uh, thing here. Let's not do that one though. Uh, let's do this solo. Okay. I'm telling you, it's gotta be the game. It's been a butt now. Oh, what's this? Uh, you already told me about this, so. Yeah, this is a floating castle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a cave. There's this thing. Okay. When it says select helper. <clears throat> let's see here. You can see by the names on the right side, though. Don't like anybody there. Just keep pushing the button, though. But it's usually random. Probably they really want me to play with that guy named Kirby, though, don't they? They raced. <laughs> that guy's outfit over there. There's also favorites. Usually it's a mixture of people who's on your list and randoms like if I turn this off though you can see which one's the friends and which one's not the friends are the ones that has the little friend gauge on them
There it goes. I like when it cuts her. Looks like I might have to hurry up here. Okay. Okay, so what I did, I went to the friend list and I went ahead and marked you down as favorite. See, we move from favorite. The friends list is over here. The friends list is over here where it looks like handshakes at the middle. I hear. Go to the magnifying glass. Sorry for any random skips though. And down in the bottom of it says we move from fav favorite, so. Now, if I'm right, I can go back over here. Okay, if I'm right, or left. Okay, I'm gonna better hurry this up because my internet's been a butt. Now. There. But you gotta make sure the switch on the bottom was his favorites turned on. I hope the video didn't get cut up though, because that's gonna be ridiculous. Gonna make sure it's about the most fun that one. My luck though, there's probably like, oh, we got an hour's worth of video though in like five seconds of the other one. Anyways, that's it for now though. So hopefully you understand most of that that I've showed you there. But anyways, Mitchie though, if you need some help though, you can let me know on Discord and such or Messenger or whatever. Just hopefully I'm up by noon. And hopefully it's something that I can actually help you with, though. But pretty sure you'll be able to figure out the rest, though. Fairly easy. Yeah. Now let's see how much of my video got cut off there because of the random cuts there. Anyways, I'm going ahead and get off, though, because I already know it's an hour ahead of from what you're at, though. Yay, I actually streamed about a few months later. Okay. Uh, wait, did I already get the free thing? Let's go check on one more thing. It's not going to show up, is it? You know what? Forget it there. I'm going to go ahead and end it. Wait, no. Oh, now you're going to do it? Yeah, I already got the free thing, okay. Okay, now I'm going to end, and let's... Hopefully that this actually was continuing one piece, so... These are... Who knows if I'm going to stream this game again, though. If I do, I do. I don't know what the next game would be. Or the next thing in general, though, I would do a live stream of. As of this recording, many people are playing around Smash Bros. and Steve, so... Okay, thanks, Michi, and... While well, I for stopping on by though, and easily getting confused, but also joining up, be sure to also uh, try out those random uh, multiplayer fights as well. That is all. Later. <laughs>